there's a drama going on in TikTok about two people breaking up, but it's actually not a drama at all. Eh. Here's everything you need to know right, about the Miss Yong Chi TikTok drama. Lah, oh. Simplify and summarize for you. Tell the CC if you don't understand my essence, you idiot. So, so, uh, so, most of us old people uh, go TikTok uh, to watch Hui Ge dance uh, in his Xiao Ting Tang t-shirt. Uh, but in case you didn't know, uh, young people uh, like to use it uh, to just talk to their followers. Uh. Usually, uh, most are uh, harmless and nothing wrong. Uh. Like this cat uh, telling us uh, to drink more water. Uh. <laughs> But in the last few days, uh, a video has gone super viral. Eh. Basically, uh, it's this 18 year old girl uh, who talked about her ex. Uh, uh. She said uh, she wanted her MacBook back from her ex, then talked a little about her ex, and uh, she said bad things about her ex, uh, saying that he's not hardworking enough. Uh. Then uh, he told her followers uh, not to date broke guys, and then corrected herself because uh, uh, she meant broke guys uh, who are lazy. Because uh. if you lazy, uh, then you'll be broke one. Ma. Okay, uh, when I first saw the initial video, I thought, okay, ma, nothing. Ma. So I scrolled to watch cats dancing again. Uh, bah! She actually uh, opened a can of worms instead. Eh. Just when we all think maybe it's all just a story, uh, the video went super viral uh, with people uh, interpreting uh, that she's a gold digger, which confused my toes. Uh, my toes uh. Why would she be a gold digger right, if she dated a broke guy before? Eh? It's like saying, uh, I want to lose weight, uh, but I eat fried chicken again. Why would it? Eh? eh? Other than people starting to say she's a gold digger and whatnot, uh, something else happened. Uh. Someone uh, started a TikTok account uh, and explained what happened. He said he's an ex uh, and gave uh, his side of the story. I can summarize everything, uh, but I'll tell you why uh, it's not needed later. So uh, in the video, uh, he showed receipts uh, of what a gold digger uh, the woman is. Uh. In the example, uh, she wasn't happy with the birthday gift. But worst of the worst, uh, instead of quarreling face to face like two adults, uh, they say uh, must quarrel in text. Eh. Even when they're side by side, it's me size. Eh, uh. If you watch this previous video, you'll know what's the problem. If not, let me pray for you. This one is a conversation between a cyclist and a car driver. Car driver asks if the cyclist is okay or not. The cyclist asks the driver if he's okay or not. So sweet. Maybe after that, they go to the fish farm to buy fish together and then cook dinner. So you think, okay? ma? Now, this is the real conversation. You okay? No, you okay? Yeah, 7% bro, 7%, 7%. So here's the thing. Quarrels uh, are essential uh, in every relationship. Because okay? if no quarrel, uh, then each partner uh, keeps to himself or herself. Uh, then you'll get worse. Because okay? face to face talking uh, transmit 100% uh, of a message instead of a text. Uh, they just transmit 7%. Uh. It's therefore imperative uh, to quarrel face to face. Uh. But, anyways, uh, then they break up. Uh, and everything, uh, everything, uh, all right, on text only. Uh, uh. So, uh, many people are interested in what happened. But here's the thing, uh, here's the thing, here's the thing. Anyone uh, who has been in a relationship uh, will know uh, this is just another Tuesday. Uh. Girlfriend not happy with a gift. Nah, babe, that time uh, my girlfriend gets super angry with me because uh, the KFC staff uh, give her crispy chicken uh, instead of original chicken and I wasn't even her boyfriend yet uh, she just suddenly remember what happened 6 days ago eh. girlfriend complaining about her boyfriend who cannot meet her expectation <laughs> if my girlfriend said I hardworking and rich uh, before, during or even after our relationship uh, then I worry <laughs> So what is this saga all about? Eh? The very fact eh, that the story eh, has now become a story eh, of the woman being a gold digger eh, who told girls eh, not to date broke guys. Whether that's true or not, it doesn't matter. Eh, Cause remember, I eh, remember, eh, TikTok eh, only know what is viral, not what is true. Which now brings us to the next question. Eh. Why like that? I ask you, eh, if a guy says he like pretty girls, will it become a saga? No, right? So why eh, when a girl says that she prefers rich guy, right? which by the way she didn't say, eh, it will become a saga? Cause the person who prefers you fuck you for kiss you for fuck you, kiss you for fuck you for fuck you for fuck you. Hey, see me side. I don't know what to say, lah. Actually, I know lah. It's called double standard, ah, whenever convenient. You know, ah, like both potato chips, ah, and pokeri, ah, are vegetables. Why say potato chips are unhealthy, eh? Why chicken rice, ah, with just one dish, ah, can sell for four dollar, but type, ah, if four dollars for a dish, ah, what kind of storm? Why that big damn lah? Basically, uh, it's a saga uh, that's not supposed to be a saga, uh, but become a saga. Uh. Cause, ah, uh, if this kind of argument, ah, uh, can be a saga, uh, then I just need to look at the mirror, uh. If you think I've learned something, consider subscribing and also watch this video to be smarter.